A disturbing story we're following out of the Fountain Blue area. A son caring for his father killed him, then covered it up. NBC 6's Sofia Hernandez joins us live from the neighborhood where this all took place. So, Sofia, what happened? Yeah, Jackie, I first want to say that arrest records share some pretty chilling and graphic details that we do want to warn our viewers about. And we do know that a son uh, had been caring for his elderly father that was 81 years old for two years in one of the homes behind me. And that on Saturday, police came here to find that elderly man lying in his bed dead. It's a fate that's surprising for neighbors of this complex in the Fountain Blue area. I was friendly with uh, with Paul he was a uh, guy he, he kept to himself most of the time but he was nice he was. now knowing that this man 53 year old David Bauer is accused of killing his father arrest records say the death of the 81 year old was strangulation and violence I was wondering myself if that's what happened arrest records say that Bauer let Miami-Dade police into the home Saturday the homicide unit found that the elderly man had numerous bruises and cuts across his body David telling police that his father had a bad fall three days ago and that the marks on his body were from him putting his dad into bed however investigators say that autopsy reports show his injuries were not consistent with a fall he's been taking care of him for for a long time yeah. which was very nice of him. Uh, I never realized that he had any other family. He was the only family that he had that I know. So and he, he took care of him for maybe he got tired of doing what he was doing. The arrest report furthers that police found blood spatters on window blinds, blood smears on the bed, and several paper towels throughout the home covered in blood. You were arrested for one count of first degree murder. The 53-year-old appearing before a judge today. He's currently facing charges of elderly abuse and murder of the first degree. And this is not the first time that David has had a run-in with the law. He has had a history of multiple felony charges, including a conviction for elderly abuse, battery, breaking and entering, theft and burglaries, and alcohol and drug possession. We're live in Fountain Blue, Sophia Hernandez, NBC6 News.